Your Natchez History Minute is brought to you by Natchez National Historical Park. The First Presbyterian Church of Natchez will celebrate its bicentennial next year, having been organized 199 years ago today on March 20th in 1817 under the ministry of Reverend Daniel Smith. But Presbyterians have been active in the Natchez area since the early territorial period, coming primarily from the eastern seaboard down the Mississippi River. In 1801, the Synod of North Carolina sent three missionaries to the Natchez area, seeking to consolidate the Presbyterian people and establish an organized work. In 1807, the Reverend James Smiley from North Carolina held services for the Presbyterians in Natchez at the Adams County Courthouse, and in 1816, the Mississippi Presbytery was organized at nearby Pine Ridge Presbyterian Church. In Natchez, the first Presbyterian house of worship was completed on a high hill in 1815 on the site of the present church. In 1828, the hill was graded to its present level, and a new and much larger church was erected, forming what is essentially the present-day sanctuary. In 1830, the galleries were added, and in 1851, a 16-foot addition brought the seating capacity of the church to 800. In 1900, Stratton Chapel was completed as a memorial to longtime minister Reverend Buck Stratton. Today, the chapel houses Natchez in historic photographs, a large exhibition of images depicting life in the Natchez area through the 19th and 20th centuries. The First Presbyterian Church of Natchez is committed to a ministry that meets the needs and addresses concerns in our church, our community, and our world. And we extend a cordial invitation to all to worship here and be part of the church's service and fellowship. Hi, I'm Reverend Noelle Reed, co-pastor here at First Presbyterian, and this has been your Natchez History Minute.